a new earth project, a new earth house. We're a division of Atlantic Packaging and we're the sustainable wing trying to push and promote sustainable packaging. And Firewire just came on board and Slater yep. Designs that mm -hmm. Kelly owns. So Kelly just got some boards received today that he was unwrapping with the new packaging. No bubble wrap, no plastic. He was telling them, when you send me boards, don't send them in packaging. Just send them send plain. Them. Yeah, I don't care if they get dings. I got a good ding repair guy and he can afford to pay for it. He just repair. didn't want the bubble wrap. He just doesn't want to deal with yeah. bubble wrap. The guilt. Uh, these these plastic air batons. Yeah, yeah. And he's like, I would ask him, what, do, what would you do with this stuff? He's like, I would normally just try and drive it back down to like Arakawa or those facilities where they pack boards and say, can you guys reuse this stuff? I, yeah. I don't want to throw it away. Yeah. yeah. In Australia, you would put your cold stuff in what we call an esky. Mm -hmm. right? I know they're the worst. You call them a cool... And that, that cool light foam, the bubbly foam, that is one of the worst products in the market. They have created a product mm. largely made out of shrimp shells. It's, it's food waste, mostly made out of shrimp, shrimp shell casings shells. for cold pack. But that stuff is going to replace styrofoam. Cruise foam, that's yeah. what it is. It's going to replace styrofoam on a global scale. It's going to change the world. We had some cold goods delivered here mm -hmm. to the house. From, like, Minnesota. Steak, by the way. Open yeah. up the cruise foam, still frozen, mm -hmm. and it's curbside recyclable. Everything's recyclable, yeah. So that's the space that these guys work in.